European shares fell sharply today after China accelerated the depreciation of the yen, sending currencies across the region reeling and domestic stock markets tumbling. Investors have expressed fears that the yen's rapid depreciation could mean China's economy is even weaker than had been imagined. World soccer body FIFA's Ethics Committee says it opened formal proceedings against Secretary General Jerome Flocker after its investigators recommended a nine-year ban against him. The committee is preparing a ruling over accusations of corruption involving the sale of World Cup tickets. China calls for efforts from all parties to realize denuclearization on the Korean Peninsula as South Korea is in talks with the United States to deploy U.S. strategic weapons to the peninsula. The German cabinet has approved plans to send up to 650 soldiers to Mali, boosting its presence in the UN peacekeeping mission in the West African country, which is beset by militant violence. Torrential rain eased in the Hunter region of South Wales today after days of flooding that has forced evacuations of residents. Flood waters inundated properties and forced road closures with some homes in low-lying areas suffering minor damage.